Okay. Okay, that's cool. Uh, to start with, uh, we'll start with basic JavaScript questions. Okay. 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 Can you tell me where latent constant with respect to hoisting? With respect to hoisting. Okay. Okay. Where is a where is a functional scope? We can we, once we declared a variable, we can reassign a value to var, and we can initialize the var before we can access the variables before initialization. Like uh, if we declare a variable a is equals to a is, let var a, then we can access it before initialization. It gives us an undefined. Just it gives us an undefined. It in a memory it stores its, its value as undefined. Where let is a block scope. Where let is a block scope, and let can also reassign a value. Once we declare, we can reassign a value. Let is also hoisted, but it it but after before accessing the value of let up before initialization, it it it, it uh, accepts it, but it throws an exception like it is also hoisted, but it throws an exception like which you need to initialize the variable and then access the let let variable. Same as const mm -hmm. const is also a block scope, and once we declare a value to const, we cannot. Reassign a value to const. If we reassign, it throws an exception, like it is already assignment as happening, already declared. Okay. Okay. Uh, I'm just sending a piece of code to your chat. Can you okay. please check it? Yeah. Hello. Yeah. Got it. Object one, console of object one and object two is same. A is twenty. A is key value is twenty. Key A like a A's value is twenty for object one and object two because object object one and object two object one is assigned to object two and object two dot A is is equals to twenty. So where that it if they are referring to the same memory. Okay. 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 Uh, my thing is, my question is, okay. let object one is equal. Uh, let object one. It is there in last line. Object one, yes. No, it will not be showing any error, right? So it will work fine. No, it it will show an error like it. Object one is already as already assigned a variable. Okay. Yeah. Like no. we are already object. using object one. So it it uh, it gives us an error like it, it already has been already where let like, uh, object one is used like we have already used that variable. Okay. Hmm. Are you sure that will be the error? Hmm. Okay. Yes. Okay. Leave it. Uh, let's go to line number two. Okay. Constant object is equal to object one, yes. and object two dot a is equal to twenty. Yes. I'm declaring object two as constant, and I'm changing the value of okay. object two. Okay. Will there be any error? No, it will no error. There will be no error because it, we are referring. It is not a value. It is a reference value. We are referring to that. Okay. Right. As you told me, object two and object one do have reference or uh, link between each other, now, yes. right? Yes. So in order to break their link. What okay. is the piece of code needs to be changed? Code needs to be can you please like that? Can you please p change that? Modify this piece of code. Okay. So that there won't be any reference between object one and object two. Okay. Yes, I shared it. Okay. Hmm. Next question is: It creates the shallow copy. L triple equal to undefined. What is expected output? It is false. 
Okay. 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 Null double equal to undefined. What is expected output? It will be true because if you consider both the values are null, right? Like it checks, it checks the types. It won't allow in if in double mm-hmm. equals true. It checks the values. It allows the type conversion okay. uh, where it it checks it like it it can it considers the null and undefined values are same in double equals true. Whereas in type in triple equals true, it checks the types. Type of null is an object and type of undefined is an undefined. So they are so it returns false. Okay. Uh, in if we use double equal to, it considers uh, both the values to be same. Okay. So null and undefined are they same? Okay. How null and undefined are same? How null and undefined are same? Yeah. Okay. Because if you say null, ah, double equal to undefined, is yes. showing true. Yes. Correct. Yes. How is it showing? How is it true? How is it true? It's like okay. a null is an which is a no value, which is an empty no value, where in JavaScript in It can it it like it uh, considers that if undefined is also a no value, it is an empty value. It has no value. Okay. Hmm. Okay. Ah, hmm. uh, that's good. Ah, uh, can you open JS Fiddle dot net link? I'm just sharing. Okay. Yeah. Can you open that link and share your screen? Okay. Just check if you can see your see. You can see your screen. Okay. Yes. So, is there in your chat? So, what I want you to do is, I want you to write a function. Which will invoke the below syntax. Okay. Okay. It invokes below syntax, which means console dot log of mul two of three of four will give us output of twenty four. Okay. Then mul four of three of four will give us output of forty eight. Okay. Which means it will get all the uh, inputs, multiply them, and send the response. Okay. And the thing is, they are not parameter for single function. Can you see the difference? It's not one comma two comma three. Yes. It's two of three of. Okay. Right. Yes.
Hello, Sweda. Yeah, hello. Uh, yeah, be on online. I'll be right back in two minutes. Okay. 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 हेलो यस वी कैन यू एग्जीक्यूट दिस डोंट सी डन Are you done? That's what I'm asking. Execute this one. Okay. Sorry, this was not necessary. Hello. Yeah. Yeah, it is. Okay. Can you run this? To see the output. Okay. Can run the, run the command on the. Can use the button on the. This one. Yeah. On the left side, it should be. You should be getting that console log. Okay, open that inspect element. See. It's not working. Can I use other other editor? Okay, fine. Okay, that's fine. Uh, maybe what you can do is uh, now what you can do is uh, write the same function without using. Sorry, by using arrow function. Same function. 
Yeah, same concept, same stuff. Yeah. Okay. That's cool. Mm. We'll move on to the next one. Yeah. Next one is there in your chat. You can just refresh the screen so that. Uh... Wait. I did not get your reference. Oh, you can refresh the editor screen so that it will work fine again. Refer, okay. Yeah. Yeah, my next question is there in your chat. any loop or any method like a yeah no loop should be used Like can you use filter method or something? What is the filter method? Hello? What is the filter method? Only filter method. Uh, is it an arrow or is it a loop? Or... It, it, hello? Is it a loop? Filter method, is it a loop? That's my question. Yes, it's it, not loop, it directs to each element in an array. Yeah, so you can use it.
depan Yes, it is one, two, three, four, and five. Five ones are there. Okay. Mm. Okay. So tell me about uh, Redux architecture. Okay, Redux architecture is like Redux is a state management tool in React, which allows us to manage the state of the application. Like through store, we will be, we'll be creating a store for the entire application. Mm -hmm. Okay. And we'll be creating a store through peer store, and we'll be through provider. We'll be wrapping the store in the parent app, wrapping okay. the app into the provider, and through connect, we'll be connecting the reducer Redux to the component, and it has reducer and action. Reducer is like initial state. It will be handling the initial state, initial state of initial state values, and action is like based on the action based on the dispatch action it takes the type it takes the type based on that type if the action is dispatched based on that type if we, we, we use an api calls we'll be dispatching an action and the payload based on that payload the reducer will be updated there is a connected two parameters one is map state to props and dispatch state to props map state to props is like it is used to map the states Map like uh, from the reducer, it maps the state. It's uh, map through state is like we can access the state values in the component in the current comp component. Dispatch is like based on the action, it will update the states. Okay. Okay. That's cool. Uh, can I tell me about uh, React uh, React hooks? React Please? hooks. Yeah. Okay. React hooks are like uh, uh, just use use state. Use it and use use effect and use rep and use reducer. Mm -hmm. yeah, mm -hmm. I, mean, I use uh, mostly I use to use rep and uh, use it and use effect hooks. Okay. 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 That's good. Cool. Uh, can I tell me what is the what are pure components? Pure components. Okay, two components implement should component update. Should component update. It, it is like it checks the previous state with current state, previous props with current props. It completes the shallow comparison of the previous state and previous props with current state and current props. And uh, it uh, only re renders if, the, if any value in state or props are changed. It will not re render. If, 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 the, if the values are same, it will not re render. It optimizes the application. It improves the optimizing of the application. So, Okay. Okay. Uh, Sridhar, I think uh, I'm done with my questions. Do you have any question for me? No, I would be more good. Okay. Uh, cheers, Sridhar. Uh, thanks for your time, Sridhar. Yeah. Uh, I'll update feedback to Sachin. Yeah, yeah, yes, yes, sir. Thank you so much. Have a good day. Yeah, thank, thank you. you.